So I've been using interactive brokers for a while now, and this video is my honest and unbiased review on the interactive brokers. I'll cover all the main points from key features to risks and considerations. So by the end of this video, you'll have a better understanding of the interactive brokers. One of its biggest strengths is the variety of trading tools and platforms it offers. For professionals and advanced users, the Trader Workstation is packed with features like algorithmic trading, options analysis tools, and complex charting features. However, this platform can be intimidating for beginners due to its complexity. To cater to less experienced users, it also offers newer and more streamlined platforms like Global Trader and the Impact app, which focuses on ESG investing. These options offer an easier to navigate experience without sacrificing functionality, making the platform more accessible to newer traders. But let's be real, it's not all sunshine and rainbows. There are some cons to consider. One downside is its limited access to IPOs and over-the-counter stocks, which some competitors offer. Also, the interface, especially TWS, may feel a bit dated or overwhelming to those who aren't as experienced. However, on the positive side, its continued efforts to improve usability with features like the newly launched desktop platform and a user-friendly mobile experience shows that they're listening to customer feedback and working on it to make the platform more approachable. Additionally, when it comes to fees, it is known for its low commissions, particularly for high-volume traders. Plus, it offers a commission-free option through Interactive Brokers Lite. However, this commission-free option comes at a trade-off, you'll lose some control over order routing, which could impact trade execution quality. Additionally, its pricing structure can be complex, with fees varying based on trading volume, which can make it tricky to estimate costs if you're an active trader. Overall, Interactive Brokers excels in offering a comprehensive and professional-grade trading experience. However, it may not be the best fit for every trader, particularly those looking for a simple, beginner-focused platform. But as always, do consider speaking with an expert before making any decisions. Well, that's all for this video. I hope you found this video helpful. And if you did, make sure you give this video a super thanks by clicking on this heart icon to help support the channel and don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you in the next one.